The recently elected members of the Dunedin City Council were officially sworn to their duty today. It fired a pofiri and mihi whakato from David Ellison. DCC Chief Executive Sue Bidrose then began the formal process of installing the Mayor and Councillors. The new faces are Conrad Steadman, Rachel Elder, Jim O'Malley, Damian Newell, Marie Laufiso and Christine Gary. Laufiso is the first woman of Samoan heritage to represent the city on council and says she's humbled to be elected. It means much gratitude to the people of Dunedin. Um, given the population um, of Māori and Tung Pacifica people, um, it wasn't totally expected, or I didn't expect it, that um, a little city, a great little city like Dunedin would um, actually elect um, a person of my background. <laughs> And so I'm very grateful and I've been very um, humbled by the many people I've spoken to since the election day. Um, people I don't know who have just approached me and um, have said congratulations and they voted for for a Green Dunedin ticket and uh, so happy that, um, that we made it. Returning Deputy Mayor Chris Staines is an old hand around the local government's table and offered some fatherly advice for new councillors. One thing for the new councillors to remember is that we are a governing body and so we have to stay away from operational issues and, and look at how the processes that are around council work and make sure that the right processes are there and then staff do the operational stuff and that's the hardest thing for anybody joining council to really understand. The re-elected councillors are Lee Vandivis, Doug Hall, Aaron Hawkins, David Benson Pope, Andrew Wiley, Chris Staines, Kate Wilson and Mike Lord. Following the official process, elected members got straight down to business. They'll be in term for the next three years. Darrell Baser, The South Today.